little crazy, little sexy, little cool Little rough around the edges, but I keep it smooth I'm always left to center and it's right where I belong I'm the random mind and don't you hear an major song Hey, hey y'all, welcome back to my channel on today's video, we are going to be redoing my toddler's room. We attacked her closet last week, so if you have not seen that video, make sure you check that out. That's what it's looking like. Still holding on strong. But we have her room here, and it is pretty basic. She's spending more time in here, and we want to redo it and revamp it for her and give her a nice space to escape her brother's. Make sure, if you have not done so already, to subscribe to my channel to see more content of me redoing things around my house, as well as me on some other projects and journey. But let's go ahead and get her together. I have a few things that I'm going to be incorporating in her room, but I'm not going to show you guys because I think I'm going to be changing some stuff up. So make sure you stay tuned for the remainder of the video to see the final look. I'm here at TJ Maxx to go in here and try to find, um, try to see what I can find as far as um, decorating for my daughter's room. And I need some kitchen to, like um, organization things. So I'm going to go in here and see what I can find real quick. Let's go. going on so um unfortunately i have to take this back i hope they i can find just the plain white one in there with um the same texture because it is so soft okay so after going to several stores today returning several things well it really wasn't that much it was like three things that i had to return i had to return the rug i had to return a comforter and um that was it that was it i just had to return a rug and a comforter well actually i i got one more comforter set that i got from walmart that i may be returning as well now when i went to tj maxx i don't know if i particularly showed you guys which throw i put in the cart but so this is the throw that I put in there and this throw was $19.99. All right, so just a little sneak. This is what is on her bed now. Now, I really, I like this, I really do. Um, what I don't like is the busyness of it. Let the people know that you are a designer, baby girl. So, just a little sneak. Now, I'm going to try this other quilt and see how this looks. Because the color is plain, but I don't know if the color actually matches. So, we're about to see. Okay. Uh, not a fan. And she always has to test them out. Like, she always has to crawl on the bed when I change something. Not a fan. Um, now, I do like the um, pelted or the like pleated look in the comforter. I do like that, but it's just very dull. And we really like vibrant and bright in here. We, that's, ouch, line. That's what we are going for in her room. So this is a no, cancel, gotta take it back. Was that cute? Was it cute? Did you like it before it fell? All right, so I got my keto fuel here with some blueberries in it. Um, and I'm getting ready to do a little magic in here. Still waiting for some packages to come from Amazon, 
but it's nothing that I can't move on without. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do what I can in here. Today's attire is super casual. I am wearing my new Legends hoodie in gray. And it is so comfortable, you guys. It's so soft and just, I love it. This is an extra large. I do believe they run by um, men's sizes. So, yeah. So, you'll have, you can know what to do. I will post the link down below so y'all can cop y'all's. But it's a full size, so we know that's not going to work. Busy, busy, busy. So, let's look at the throws. Okay. I like this. But like I told you all, uh, my concern with these types is that she's going to be hot, like, all the time, all year. I like the quilt style ones. Oh boy, oh boy. So, at this point, this but I don't think it's big enough
I'm getting her this one for her little keepsake stuff. And I think I'll get this one for the boys for their costumes in their closet. So this is kind of what I mean about I'm kind of over unicorn stuff. But I like this too. It's just so small. Hey, hey y'all, excuse the bonnet, it is night and I will be going to bed shortly after this, but I definitely wanted to get up here and show you guys her, the finished product of her room. Really been finished with her room for about like a week now and it's just been not filmable, um, if you know what I mean, like as far as just like the toys and everything like that. So it just, I just haven't been able to really film. Um, and then I also wanted to show you guys at night so you can get the whole little full glow effect of the lights that I have going on in here, her little salt lamp. Um, this is pretty much a outline of where I'm going with her room. I won't say it's the complete product because I'm pretty sure here and there I'll be changing things and I'll find things and add things. I know for a fact one thing that I want to change is this older table here that I painted along with um, her crib that we painted before um, before she made her grand entrance into the world. We did paint this so the paint is kind of chipping on it from just um, them playing around it and things like that and it's just rectangular uh, cube toy holder from Walmart. It did not come with the bins. The bins actually came from Amazon. Um, and then we got her TV from a pawn shop. We got that circular rug from Five Below. And we got this rug right here from Burlington. It's very, very soft. Like, it's so soft. The chair we got from Ross. Um, she been had that little bin with her little babies in it. Now, as you saw in the video, I was struggling with comforter um, for
for her because everything that I was coming across was just too busy. It's just very hard to try to find something very plain and glam for a baby's bed, especially a toddler bed. So I just ended up going with a throw that we got from TJ Maxx. Um, it's very, very soft. It will keep her warm and it is fluffy. It is for a full size bed. No, it's for a twin size bed. But um, once it's tucked and everything like that, because I really just don't like the whole falling over the bed type look. So we tucked it. Um, so this little princess canopy came from Five Below and they did have them in white and in pink. And honestly, you cannot really tell that this is pink on camera. Um, in person, it's very, very faint. It's very light pink. Um, so you guys already know that from the before video. I already had this little unicorn sticky up on the wall and we had got these from Dollar Tree. This one and this one over here we got from Dollar Tree and they were in here prior to anything else as well as this picture here. This came from Ross um, because I always knew that these were the colors that I really wanted to do in her room. Uh, so while we're over here, we'll go to this little box I got from Burlington and it just says believe in your dreams and inside of it is basically things that I just don't want to get rid of like keepsakes a little keepsake box but it's very cute it's a little treasure chest type thing so because that's what they are to me little treasures that I don't want to get rid of but I didn't want them to be an eyesore in the closet so this flower piece here I just love the dimensions so as we're closer up you can kind of see that where the paint chipped this was something that we had in like our utility closet um, at our old house and it basically kept um, just random stuff on it so and in prior to us um, switching her room around we pretty much just kept um, like boxes of pampers up here just very very random stuff up here so I have a book shelf well it's not really I can't I really don't know what to call it it's just basically like some type of stand with some shelving um, so this is what I mean about the room was just not able to be filmed see I, I didn't even know that Bob was in that bucket that's her Easter bucket though so yeah, every time I try to film in here, my shadow is in here. See, she already moved the chair. <laughs> so, uh, like I was saying, I love the dimensions. Lonnie. I love the dimensions on this plant and this book we got from Ross as well as this plant here. Um, it, it is fake. But I just loved it. The salt lamp we got from Five Below. And this unicorn here we got from Home Goods. This sequin pillow here uh, we got from Ross. Yes, we got this sequin pillow from Ross. And what I love about this pillow, well, both of these pillows actually, is that. Hold on, let's see. Where did we get this Hello. from? Oh no, we got we got this sequin pillow from Home Goods. And what I love about this pillow, both of them actually, is that if I was to get a different comforter, I could just kind of, you know, see they can go like that, and they could be matchy matchy, or we can have the pink and purple. Or we can have the sequin in purple. And I do, as I showed y'all before, or as I told y'all before, my little, my little stylist here, my little interior designer of her own room, picked out her own pillows. Um, basically what she did is we were going down and uh, going through the pillows and I picked pillows up that I liked and she picked between the ones that she did like and one that she didn't. So that's how we ended up with those. 
So this little bear here, she loves to just snuggle up with that bear. My mom got her that um, from her baby shower. These lights came from TJ Maxx. The lights actually had some little clamp clamps on them, pictures on these lights. So, and of course I just took those off and just put them around her window. Originally I did have them around the canopy, but that seemed like a fire hazard, <laughs> even though I liked it. Um, I was like, yeah, we'll just keep it a little simpler with it around the window. And as you guys saw, this is the, uh -oh, baby. this is uh -oh. the picture we got from Burlington that I showed, I was a little in between. And what I love about this is it brings together all the colors. Um, especially like bringing in the purple time and the purple that's on her bed and then the pink and the teal and then there's some gray and there's actually um, there's actually some yellow in here that I could be bringing out so I just love it so um and I just love this too it's like a great way to conceal the toys so overall and this little laundry basket we got from five below um, so, and the sign that was on her door came from Dollar Tree. So, overall, at the, at the moment, I am very, very, I'm very pleased with the outcome of everything. She really loves it. She spends a lot more time in here. Um, and it's just very girly. It's very serene. I just love it in here. I actually asked her if I could share this room with her. <laughs> so don't be surprised if you see me filming and you see the background kind of looks like this because I just love it in here. So thank you so much you guys for watching. If you like what you see here, make sure you give this video a thumbs up, comment, subscribe. I would love to hear your ideas. If you have anything that, um, that will go well in here that is budget friendly make sure you guys let me know because i'm all about saving a coin okay love you guys until next time say bye kamani goodbye